Hi guys, Steven here. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to embed your Spotify playlist into your WordPress website, just like this one right here. I'm going to show you guys how to do this using the Divi theme, the Elementor page builder, and the default WordPress blog editor. So let's get started. Okay guys, the first thing you need to do is to log into your Spotify account and search for the playlist or the artist you want to embed into your wordpress website so, so if you already have a playlist you can go ahead and click on playlist and copy the embed code and embed into your own website but, but for this tutorial i'm going to be using one of my friend profile mr west to show you how you can embed a playlist into your wordpress website guys know that i'm using the desktop version of spotify here you need to download the desktop version of spotify to be able to see this share option if you're on the if you're on the web version of spotify you're not going to see this share option right here or well, let me show you what the uh, web version of spotify looks like so here is the web version of spotify so if you click on it right here you can see it will ask you to open this in a desktop app so you can go ahead and click on it and download the desktop app and log into your spotify again and then it will you will come to this version of the spotify which is the desktop version and you can go ahead and click on share copy the embed code and then log into your wordpress website so you can see here i'm logged into my wordpress website so i'm going to show you how to do this with the divi team first so we'll go ahead and enable the visual builder so now that the divi builder is enabled what we need to do now is to add a new role so I'm going to add two column row here and I'm going to look for the code module. So we're going to select this module right here. And then here inside the code module, you want to paste that embed code that we copied from Spotify. As you can see here, you can see with that we have the playlist right there. If you want to embed a single instead of the whole playlist, like I have here, you can see this is a single. If you want to embed that as well, you can do the same. You can simply just duplicate this. Uh, move it over here. now we need to go back to Spotify instead of copying the instead of copying the entire playlist we can go to the specific song that you want to embed if you hover over that song right here you can see this little uh, three dots right here you can click on it and then you can copy the embed code right here and then go back to your WordPress website so we want to add that to this one we can just click on this module setting right here and then here you can just delete this code and paste the new one and here you go guys so this is how you do it uh with DB team uh let me quickly show you how you can get rid of this space right here you can just go to the module uh row setting right here and go to design and sizing right here we can, you can reduce the width like that if you if you want it to come together so okay just go ahead and play around with it i'm going to go ahead and show you how to do this with elementor as well okay now let's do the same thing with the elementor page builder okay Okay, guys, as you can see that I'm logged in with the Elementor page builder right here. What I'm going to do here is to add the HTML code. You can see here, I find the HTML and I can just insert it here.
pressed it. As you can see right here that we have uh, the same playlist right here. We have the playlist and we have the and we have the single right here. So guys, it's basically the same thing. You can do this with any other page builder that have a code module or HTML module. You can just use that and paste it here. And if they don't have the HTML module, you can use the default WordPress custom HTML. This one right here, custom HTML. And here you can paste the content right there. So if your page builder doesn't have a custom HTML, you can use the default uh, WordPress custom HTML and it works basically the same way and you can paste it right there and you can see that we have the song right here. Okay guys, that's how you do it with Elementor. Okay guys, I'm going to show you guys how to do this with the default WordPress blog editor. So I'm going to embed the Spotify code into a blog post uh, just to show you guys how this works. So the first thing you need to do is to add a new blog. So to add a new blog, just click on this uh, plus icon right here, add blog. And I'm going to choose the custom HTML and I'm going to post the embed code that we copied from Spotify. You can see right here. So if I update this and view post, so you can see that we have the Spotify single inside the blog post right here. So I'm going to go back to edit post. Okay, so if you want to have it side by side, uh, just like we we have it here side by side with the Elementor page builder, if you want to do the same with the block editor, you can go ahead and add a new block and scroll down to layout elements and then select columns and then we can select two columns like this and now it's inside this first column and um, we'll add a new block we'll add the custom html we can post the embed code in here and then in this one we add another custom html and then i'm going to go back to spotify and uh copy the entire playlist embed code right here and I'm going to go back here and paste that in here and update and then we're going to view this in a new tab guys you can see here we have it side by side right here and that's how you do this using the default WordPress editor. Also, uh, let me quickly show you guys how you can also add this in your sidebar. If you want it to be in your sidebar instead, you can add this in your sidebar right here. So let's go back to this post. Uh, to do that, uh, we need to go to document. And right here that we have sidebar, you can see that no sidebar is selected because there's no sidebar right here. So we need to select the right sidebar here. So now that we have the right sidebar selected, I'm going to update this. And now you need to click to this WordPress icon right here. So that will bring you back to the dashboard. If you want to go to appearance and go to widgets. Okay, guess we're right here on, on the widgets section. You can see here that we have the main sidebar. Here you can see all the things that we have inside the main sidebar. 
which is the right sidebar that we just selected uh, earlier. So what we need to do is to find the HTML, the custom HTML, and drag it into the sidebar. Uh, we already have one here. Uh, you can just uh, delete one. Or if you want to have uh, two, you can go ahead and drag two in there. And then here you can put, you can paste the, maybe the, this one is for the playlist. And then we can go back here and copy a single one. And then you can embed the single one in here. Right there and save that. Done. Done. Okay, so if we go back here and refresh this blog post, now you can see that we have a sidebar right here with your Spotify embedded nicely uh, inside the sidebar. Okay guys, that's how you embed your Spotify playlist into your WordPress website. If this video was helpful, please smash that subscription button and hit that notification bell so you get notified when next we upload a video. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.